and welcome to my Assassin's Creed Brotherhood multiplayer session of Chest Capture. This one is in Castel Gandolfo and I am once again with my buddy Fats. Now if you watched my previous Chest Capture video, this is an immediate continuation from it. Uh, we all did a rematch. In fact, um, not quite all. <laughs> there was one person that sent me hate mail at the end of the last one and like oh, something about spawn camping and uh, funnily enough he didn't rematch. I mean what a shame. Like, I really wanted to murder him. <laughs> so we are now going off, well we have to protect the chests in this round so we have to do lots of killing. As I mentioned in the last video as well, I'm still pretty new to um, chest capture. I'm not that experienced in it. Um, but as it goes, I mean, myself and Fax, we seem to make a really good uh, team. You know, when we play Manhunt and e even in this now, we just seem to uh, really kind of, you know, bounce off each other in a way. It's uh, really good teammates. So yeah, he, he kind of helps me out on a few occasions, really, if I get stuck. <laughs> I found this particular round <laughs> really quite awesome. I really enjoyed this. I mean, we are guarding this golden chest with our lives. With our lives! <laughs> because uh, we really don't want them to grab it, so... <laughs> I epically waste a poison again. I did that in the last one too. <laughs> oh goodness me. God, that made me laugh so hard when I was in the game. <laughs> it even makes me laugh now just watching it. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. I wonder if he even spotted me. Uh, that was just a crazy ass move, really, wasn't it? Just to run straight past a pursuer like that. <laughs> now, I don't, I don't know really what that last guy was referring to when he said spawn camp. Because it's not actually possible in Brotherhood, because, you know, there's no way to tell where somebody is going to respawn. Um, so it really has to be, it would have to be an extremely lucky guess each time. Um, but as for a round like this, this couldn't possibly be classed as, like, spawn camping, because at the end of the day, your objective is to guard that treasure chest with your life. So, you know, that's what you're going to do, isn't it? I mean, some people uh, will run off and go and try and find the targets uh, before they get, like, even anywhere near the chest. Uh, but, you know, we just have this strategy to stay and guard this one. And he's trying to be sneaky as well there. Look, it's just not working. <laughs> it's so funny. We just fail everything. So yeah, I, I'm just going to loiter around this area, you know, I, I don't want them stealing it. And uh, I, I did know uh, that that was a target, it was just too obvious to me, really obvious. I'm not sure why, I think it's because normally when NPCs walk around that area, they don't normally walk around on their own, they're normally like the group of four. So, because he came walking through those doors um, on his own, that just made me think that, hey, that's a target. Did I say target or pursuer before? Because I did mean target. Sorry, totally not with it today. <laughs> oh, anyway, but they've managed to steal the chest somehow, so I've gone to poison him. Now this guy here is running after him and if you watched the last chest capture video, he's the same person that intercepted my poison 
in the last one and I said in the video that you know I think the message sank in uh, because he didn't intercept my poison in this round but then thinking about it I just realized that he actually did go chasing after that target so if he'd have caught up to him if my poison hadn't have worked he damn well would have intercepted again ah <laughs> oh no Anyway, uh, at least he didn't intercept, but he didn't get a chance to. So we're going to go on to round two now, so it's our turn to try and steal the chest. And uh, at the moment, it's three of them against four of us. So I suppose, in a way, the odds are quite heavily stacked in our favour. <laughs> so that's always nice. I'm going with my normal... Um, wanted profile set here i know some of you are like you know why are you using disguise and poison when you know you're in the round where you know you, you don't kill anyone yeah. well the reason is is just because i want disguise i just want the disguise that's all i'm after and um, i i don't really want to change the profile set because i use it predominantly for wanted and I would hate to go into a wanted match and completely forget to change my profile sets back. So, yeah, I'm just keeping it as it is at the moment and just sticking with the disguise. So, in a way, I've kind of made the game a bit harder for myself because I'm only my give, uh, giving myself, like, one defence. I know that the pursuers are there, but I thought to myself, I don't care, you know, that there's only a very, very short amount of time that I need to be able to steal that final chest. And so I just took the risk and it paid off. So that was quite good. Although running like that didn't pay off. I've been really, really loving playing uh, chest capture, and I'm finding it really easy to get matches now. I don't play it in ranked. If I go to try and get a ranked match, it is just so impossible. But to get a player match, it's really easy. <laughs> this bit makes me laugh so much. <laughs> Do you know that that's kind of like exactly the same as what happened before i mean it's in exactly the same spot only the roles are reversed <laughs> oh that's just so funny oh dear oh wow <laughs> oh again did he just run past me and not even spot me i i just don't oh what <laughs> Oh dear, sorry, I must calm down because I <laughs> just find that's hilarious. <laughs> oh gee. <laughs> yeah, so sorry. Um player matches, yeah. If you <laughs> sorry. If you go into player matches in chest capture <laughs> I'm really, really sorry. I've got a giggle fit here. Um <laughs> and I made an epic fail there because I just ran right into a pursuer. But yeah, go into a player match in chest capture and you'll probably not have any difficulty at all trying to get a match. Yeah, it's quite easy. <laughs> oh dearie me. I do actually have my microphone on in this match, but you just can't hear me because my recording equipment doesn't pick it up. And this is why I think disguise is really invaluable in this, in both rounds. Uh, because, you know, the pursuers are everywhere and you can so easily get away with stealing those chests if you have disguise. It's just almost like taking candy from a baby. We try to get a, a really good stun look on the go here, but oh, that kind of like epically fails for me on that part. It's a shame I didn't have smoke bomb then actually. But yeah, we were trying to uh, get three, <laughs> get all three of them, you know, down and stunned. Ignore the score times too. Like I said, this is my wanted profile set, and so I'm not set up for playing chess capture at all with this.
So that's another one stolen. Awesome. <laughs> I was trying to get a stun there, but uh, I, I don't know what went wrong. Uh, something went slightly wrong with my uh, camera angle ability. I, I kind of like wasn't in control of anything right at that point. So not really sure what happened. But anyway, not to worry. <laughs> I got killed. So I really want to try and get this one, but I don't think that there's really enough time to. And uh, not be, I mean, mainly because there's pursuers just everywhere, isn't there? But yeah, I mean, that, that that was pretty good. I really enjoyed that match. So we finished first, and I'm just incredibly delighted with it. And I will definitely be playing more of this, and it will definitely be me and Fact teaming up again, I can assure you. And anyway, if you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe and don't forget to check out the links in the video description for my Twitter, Facebook and live stream. See you soon. Bye!